I was about to start playing D&D again after probably some 10 years. Fresh group and new characters, pen and paper, character sheets, shining never used dice, and even miniatures. I could feel the excitement in the air. My character was a tiefling rogue who worked for the Dockers Guild of Suzeo, which was secretly a criminal organization trying to overthrow, overthrow the crown. The DM set up his screen and mentioned that I had received a note inviting me to the home of a retired adventurer, along with other characters who would then become our party. Her son's ship had been assaulted by an undead crew on the Sea of Fallen Stars. The undead pirates were known to have occupied an ancient dungeon in one of those islands, filled with dangers. She offered a reward for those brave enough to rescue and avenge her son. <laughs> I'm out, I thought. I'm so out. That's what I really thought. I mean, what? Risking my diabolically soft, tiffling skin on a dungeon in the middle of nowhere for the son of someone I didn't even know? I mean, sorry, lady. I got more important stuff to do around here. Among them, a cocoa and coffee tiffling skincare routine and a revolution to prepare for. But that's not what I said. I went along with it, not to spoil everyone's fun. And it was a fun adventure after all, but I really don't think that my character would ever get involved in that hot mess to start with. And that was not the kind of story that I really wanted to help our group to tell. And because of that, I don't think I put as much energy as I would have if I were more engaged. I think that the DM note noticed that, and I think that it was a bit of a frustrating experience for both of us. And here's why... I think that was a terrible adventure hook. If I, as a player, feel that my character doesn't care for the story and quests he's facing, I'm immediately less engaged. And that's a big step towards a low-energy, boring game session. I started to pay much more attention on how I build my adventure hooks when I realized how important they are to kick off a game session with a great energy and with high player engagement. For me, a great adventure hook is one that is compelling for my character's goals and motivations, usually because it is somehow closely tied to my character's backstory. A great adventure hook immediately creates a deep connection of my character with the adventure and raises my curiosity and engagement. And that's a big step towards a high-energy, exciting game session. In other words, Great adventure hooks are those that have a great fit with the characters of our party and the players of our D&D group.